Hey there, this is Heather with TwoBlooms.com and in this Lightroom tutorial I'm going to show you um, what collections are and how to use them in Lightroom and how you can create your own to simplify your workflow and be even more organized um, in your Lightroom editing and your performance. So let's get started. Um, basically what a collection is, it's a group of photos. You see down here I have different collections for different themes. I have, you know, um, a photo book collection that I put a bunch of pictures in it to create a photo book in Lightroom. I have different photo categories that I have my favorite photos in these categories, um, so on and so forth. So you can use collections to keep your photos even more organized. So I'm going to show you um, how to add some photos into a collection. My biggest collection is um, one that's labeled my boys. It just has a bunch of pictures of my boys, the ones that I've, you know, my favorites from over the years. Um, and this is really helpful if I want to go to print off photos. I don't have to sift through every single folder on in my library folders to find the ones that I want. They're already in the collection and I can go ahead and export them directly from there or do whatever I want with them inside of Lightroom. So my latest session that I have all mostly edited, um, I'm a little backed up on my personal editing which tends to happen quite often. Um, I'm going to pick a few favorites from here and I'm just gonna kind of randomly pick a couple that I would put in my collection that I might want to print for later or put in an album. So um, what you basically do is just click on the photo, the thumbnail, you select it and you drag it into the collection. Now you can do more than one so I could, um, I'm pushing down my control key or it could be the command key on a Mac. and you can select more than one and drop them over into your collection. So now you see these photos have been added to the collection and they always go in order. So from the first photo in the f collection is always the one that was imported first in Lightroom and then they go in order. So that is really handy too. It helps you kind of keep organized like um, how they what order they were taken in and what years and whatnot. So anyways, let's keep going. If you have never created collections before, you just come up here to this little plus sign and you can create a new collection. You can create a collection, a smart collection. I'm not going to go into all of these different types. A smart collection is basically um, Lightroom will kind of do it for you, but I like to have complete control so I'm going to create a collection and I'm going to label it 2015 favorites and um, for these options I can include the selected photos that's fine um, sync with the Lightroom mobile that's something that I don't use right now I could always make new virtual copies um, these options are really for your personal preference. So I'm just going to just go ahead and select create and it's going to create this new collection and since I had those other photos already highlighted and I had that option checked it already put those photos in here for me. So then I can come over here and I can go through each one of my folders and I can go through and add different photos from different sessions or different folders into this 2015 favorites. So I'm just going to click on a few that I personally like and here we go. Now I'm going to click on 2015 favorites and you can see how that has been added. So collections are really great for organizing if you're wanting to keep different photos from different sessions in one spot 
this is a really great option if you use your um, your print module and you want to create different collages for certain things but you don't want to have to um, go through each folder because honestly if you're going through each folder you can only use one session per time or one folder per time using the print module so having them in collections you can come over to the print module and you can just put them in a quick collage like I have here and you're done whereas if you were to come back to the library and choose one of your um, folders you don't have that option you know you can't just put a couple in here from this session go back to your library pick a different session we'll just you know choose this one those photos are gone so having a collection is really helpful for using the print module for using the book module and just keeping your photos in one place so I hope you found this tutorial useful and that you are able to use it in your workflow and really optimize Lightroom to its best performance it's a really great tool to use so anyways if you found this tutorial useful I'd appreciate a thumbs up and if you'd like to subscribe to our channel, um, I come out with new Lightroom videos very often. So thanks for tuning in, and I hope to see you next time. Bye.